I get money and looking for folk. Then I hit cows and book me some hours. Everyone loves me. I'm in my mood. I'm in my mood. I'm in my mood. Everyone loves me. Hello, everyone. This is Al Kabir, the analyst. And today, I will be going over the Eagles tried to get Christian McCaffrey. Kareem Hunt? Are we going to get Kareem Hunt? I'm not sure. But I think the Eagles will possibly make another move. But this is Al Kabir, the analyst. Let's get into it. Um, trade deadline is coming up November 1st. Um, I heard that we tried to give uh, you guys probably heard the same thing too that we tried to get Christian McCaffrey for a third and a fourth. I think that was more of a let's see what we can get. We give him a third and a fourth. If we get him, we got him for cheap. If we don't, we don't. But I was kind of surprised they put in an offer for Christian McCaffrey. I'm not sure if they put in an the offer for Brian Burns. I, I can't guarantee that as that wasn't leaked. But Christian McCaffrey, the way Miles Sanders been playing, well, he's top five in rushing. He's getting in the end zone. He, as much as in, as injury prone as Miles Sanders, I think Christian McCaffrey worse. Christian McCaffrey, for the years he's been in the league, he only had two seasons over 1,000 yards. He did have a season over 1,000 in passing. Well, receiving yards, which is really good for a running back, especially the style we play. But he just would have been another Miles Sanders, another Kenneth Gainwell, and another Boston Scott, in my personal opinion. Now, if you're going to get any running back, if you're going to get any running back, it got to be Kareem Hunt. Got to be Kareem Hunt. He's a power back. You don't have to rely on the sneak too much, even though I think the sneak is unstoppable. But you won't have to rely on it too much with a Kareem Hunt. You know how to get in the end zone. Who is explosive? So if you're going to get any running back, I think him, Miles Sanders, and Kareem Hunt will complement each other more than the CMC and the Miles Sanders, in my opinion. Now you got Miles Sanders, Kareem Hunt, and Kenneth Gainwell. Not sure if we're going to bring up Boston Scott to the after roster or not, but that's more of a good mix instead of CMC and Miles Sanders. I think we have found a way to make it work, but it, it just doesn't gel together like a big body running back and a scat back per se. Um, Now, I didn't get in. I didn't say this in the beginning, but I want to talk to NFC East a little bit. NFC East is looking like the best division in football. Say what you want about Washington. They are three and four. Washington right now will be the best team in the NFC South. Let me say that again. Washington right now, who is the worst team in the division, will be the best team in the NFC South. Whereas the Tampa Bay Buccaneers are three and four and on top of that division. I think Washington will be better than all those teams as of today. Now I want to get into the Cowboys. Cowboys only lost two games. They lost to the Bucks. They lost to the Eagles. That is what it is. But they only lost two games. We're only two games ahead of them. Talk about the Giants. Giants on some Mickey Mouse winning games type junk. But they're winning games. They're disciplined. Don't get too much penalties. Don't turn the ball over. They're a very disciplined team. That's how they find any ways to win games. Jacksonville almost got them. Absolutely. Jacksonville almost caught them slipping. But they found the way to win that game. Now the Eagles undefeated. I'm not relying on the other team. I just think we just got to handle our food. But we are the best division in, in the NFC. All we have to do with the Eagles, just keep our foot on the gas. And if we could add another piece before the trade deadline just to make us better, go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Because this division is pretty. This division is so tough. It's like, well, if you get knocked off your spot, your record will be better than any other team. But because you're not a division winner, you'll be in a wild card. This is what it is. What do you think and how do you feel about the NFC East in general? Are you shocked that we tried to get Christian McCaffrey? And should the Eagles make another move before the trade deadline? Because the NFC East is for real. It's for real. But this is Al Kabir, the analyst. Ghost. Hey.
Bis morgen.